Hey, it's Diego with Aimshoot Develop, and today I'm talking about this very cool digital camera. It's made by a company called Glitchworks, and it's a circuit bent camera. So instead of getting images that look like this, images will look like this. The camera itself has had some modification done to allow real time effects to happen. While admittedly, I actually don't know how it works, I kind of know how to use it. The camera functions how any digital camera would function, but there's three switches along the top of the camera that toggle the effects. Each one of these switches has three positions, so you can constantly adjust until your image sees fit. As I was saying previously, what you see in the viewfinder or display is what you'll get as a final image. The original camera is a Canon PowerShot 530, which shoots at about 5 megapixels. This does also allow you to turn off all the effects, and here's what an image would look like. You can also use the camera's other features, like its video feature. Growing up in the era when these cameras were new, I'm strangely nostalgic for this look. And even as you're recording in real time, you can change the effects. Another cool thing you can do is use the AV out and connect it to a TV. This is my clear prison TV. The camera will output in color video, just my TV happens to be black and white. But all the effects and grain still look really great on this TV. Other than the custom modding, this is genuinely just a simple point and shoot. It runs off of two AA batteries and an SD card to save it. There is also a CR1220 sub battery. I think it's just to keep the camera's internal clock functioning. I do also use this dongle, connects an SD card to my phone. Just import the images and videos and send them off to anybody in the photos. This page is primarily about film photography, so this is actually pretty crazy. Lastly, the thing I find the coolest is the paint job. Each one of these is custom made by Glitchworks, so no two cameras are perfectly alike. I could genuinely see how this camera might not be everyone's cup of tea, or I've even heard saying you can just edit the images later to look like that. At the end of the day, nothing genuinely beats a standalone item that just gets it right the first time. I love handing this camera off to people who aren't photographers and seeing how they choose to make the image look. I'll have links to everything including Glitchworks Instagram and their Etsy shop if you want to check them out yourself. This video is not sponsored, I just want to highlight people who are pushing the medium of photography forward. And if you found this video organically, make sure to check out my other videos where I talk about cameras you've probably never seen before. I can personally guarantee you'll find a camera you've never even knew existed. Make sure to subscribe to follow along this camera journey. Well, that's pretty much it. Keep shooting film. Take care. Peace.